pro boxing fans, Teddy Atlas, we've just seen Zile Zhang stop Deontay Wilder. Just give me your thoughts on that fight. Not a shock. It's not shocking. You know, Wilder hasn't looked good, you know, recently, obviously. And it didn't look like his legs won to him, even from the beginning. And I said it the other day when I talked to you and the, all the other microphones that were coming at me, that those Fury fights took a lot out of Wilder. And Wilder always, obviously, always his greatest asset was his power. It saved him many times. You know, you have that great eraser. It can get rid of a lot of mistakes. But sooner or later, you pay when your technique is poor. And Wilder, quite frankly, it's, you know, you got to give him credit. He won a heavyweight title. Al Heyman did a hell of a job with him. You know, he made a lot of money. You know, he won a lot of fights, but mostly with the power of the right hand, his technique was not really what won fight for him. And his technique betrayed him again. You know, here, you can see he reached in with a punch out of position, out of balance, looking for the big shot. And Zhang caught him with a right hook, which really is the Southpaw's best weapon, the right hook. You know, everyone thinks about the straight left hand, a power punch for a Southpaw, but the right hook is the punch that an orthodox fighter is not used to seeing coming from the side, you know, from the peripheral. And that's why it's such a dangerous punch. And he caught him with the right hook, and then, of course, Wilder got hurt, he turned, and Zhang did what you're supposed to do. He followed him, and he caught him again, and he, he finished him. But um, no no shock. I I mean, you would think that the fight plan would be what I, matter of fact, I just got interviewed by the zone before the fight started. And they said, how do you see it? I said, I see Zhang backing him up, keeping him off balance, and you know, looking to get rid of him eventually. There's two ways to fight a puncher. You move like Fury did the first time, and you give angles, you keep more balance, you use your legs so he can't get set to punch. Or you back him up so he can't be set to punch. Sang chose that one. He backed him up for the most part, hurt him early, and then, you know, Wada was still there. And then, of course, what round was that? The sixth or the fifth? Yeah. Finally, finally again, he caught Wada reaching in, looking for the big shot, which is what, you know, has gotten him here. And he, he left himself wide open for the southpaw right hook. Teddy, what, what do you make of, uh, finally, uh, Daniel Dubois and Hergovic? Daniel Dubois stopping Hergovic? Dubois has, you know, I always talk about it's one thing to fight like a champion, but the most important thing is to behave like one. Now he behaves like one. You know, he, he redeemed himself, quite frankly, in the Miller fight. You know, a lot of people hide from the truth and say, oh, there's... But in the... And his two losses to Joyce and Uzik, you know, we always knew Dubois could fight, but could he always behave like a fighter? And um, he, he sure as hell behaved like one against Miller. I give him all the credit in the world. He redeemed himself. And I said, that fight was for him. It was for him, to, for his soul, you know, for him as a person, as a man, to feel right about himself. And he carried that. He carried that into this fight. And one thing I, I told people yesterday that if his resolve was still there, being, talking about obviously, obviously uh, Dubois, he would win this fight. And his resolve was there. And, and it was there early on. He got hit a lot of right hands early on by Herzovich. But he, you know, he went through it. He went through the fire. And then he got to Herzovich. Uh, Herzovich gasses. And Dubois doesn't gas. That, that was part of it. But really, the most important thing was Dubois' resolve that he came here to behave like a fighter and and act like a champion. And you know what? I'm, he deserves it. Teddy Allen, it's always a pleasure to talk to you, sir. Thank you very much. We will catch up before you leave. Thank you very much for talking to Pro Boxing fans.